I want to bring in now um, Ed Asner, the famous actor, the well-known actor. Um, thank you for joining us, Ed, if I may call oh, you that. You um, just want to get your thoughts on this, this really sad story that we are all shocked to have to report tonight. Yeah, I am, I am uh, very distressed that uh, he was that unhappy. Uh, and it's, uh, it's also uh, quite clear that when we do these things, we are very alone. And I am uh, sorry, terribly sorry that he was so alone because... Do you have any idea of, of what any any specifics in his depression? And I, do, I know you don't need a specific that it's a mood state and you can, to the outward world, look like you were on top of the world, which he did. The incredibly successful actor, an Oscar winner, beloved. Um, but yet, do you have any inkling as to what the depression was related to, if anything specific? No, of course, it, it, you know, it is a mindset that... Uh, I guess the, the, the best psychiatrists can't clear through. And I'm sure he had a lot of help during his uh, years of life. Uh, you reach a point where uh, we regard ourselves as a loser and we can not pull ourselves up out of that sump, that pit. And um, suicide is the is the uh, means of liberation. I, uh, Do you think that there's any sense that Hollywood is sort of a, almost a disposable culture and that no matter what you've achieved, Oscar winner, globally famous, really revered, that if you're not like the object of the moment, and he had recently had a CBS show called The Crazy Ones that was canceled after a short run, that you can feel... Uh, you can get a, a mistaken sense that maybe the world has passed you by, even though it hasn't. Uh, I, I, I suppose so. Uh, I think the, cancel the cancellation of the show might have been a, a final blow to whatever was torturing him and depressing him. But uh, uh, the uh, the conditions were there, and if not now, then, then sometime later. And uh, well, one could always surmise it, no matter how giddy he may have made us feel uh, with his humor, that he was not a happy man. He was a Pagliacci. He was a what? And, uh, a Pagliacci. A, uh, a clown who, uh, who was unhappy.